everyone my name is Marcia and welcome to my channel in today's video I'm unboxing kind of a large haul from Macy's they were having their 15% off of beauty sale and then also I noticed they had a ton a ton of great really really great gifts with purchase so I ended up getting a couple of things more than a couple as you can see um, because again, it was 15% off and then also really good gifts with purchase. So I picked a bunch of things up and I'm gonna share with you the items I ended up getting for myself. And also at the end of the video, we're gonna be selecting the winner for the Chanel giveaway. So make sure you stay until the end to see um, if you have won. And if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I upload two to four times a week and I do two to five giveaways every month. And I would love to have you here. So if you are passionate about um, skincare and fragrance and beauty products, hit the subscribe button. I would love to have you here. But now let's go ahead and open these up. I'm gonna, as always, open up the boxes, lay everything out in front of me on my table here and we will go through each of the items. So everything is out of the shipping boxes and I have to say I'm really disappointed with how everything was shipped. It was a big order, I mean, and everything got shipped without any protection. There was no bubble wrap, there was no padding of any kind and a lot of my stuff came in really not the best condition not condition you would expect because you know i i didn't just buy this from um a garage sale <laughs> you know if you will or like a flea market this came from macy's you know these are all brand new items so i expect them to be in perfect condition and I'm really disappointed. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about in a minute. So um, I got this Jo Malone set. I really, it caught my eye and um, again, it was 15% off plus the free gift with purchase. So I picked it up, but so the, the top of the box came separate from the set. It wasn't on it or anything. Like, I don't know why but um it's a candle set luckily it didn't get it's not broken but i wanted to have the presentation like this is usually on top of the box but in mine it was just laying in my box like this <laughs> i don't know why but it's basically this set right here so um let me see does it say anything here so it's the Travel Candle Trio and Lantern. And what really caught my eye is the Lantern. This is like this right here, I guess, that you can put over the candle. It says Jo Malone on it, and it has these cutouts. And I thought it was gonna look really pretty once you light up a candle with all the cutouts. It's gonna like look so glowy. So this is the size of the candle that you get in here. So this one here is, okay, it doesn't tell me the size, but it's basically like their smallest size. And basically you would put the lantern over like so. And I think it's gonna look really cute with this cover. So the scents that you get in here, you get three candles. So you get pine and eucalyptus. Oh, that's very nice. It's very, very fresh. Mm, that smells actually really good. <laughs> the second one is English Pear and Freesia, which is my all-time favorite. <sighs> I love this scent so much, you guys. And then the last one is Lime, Basil, and Mandarin. <sighs> Another really good one. <laughs> yeah, it smells so, so good. Mmm. So, so good. So that's the set that I picked up. And again, I don't know why, but it, the box came opened up like that. So I don't know what that means, but I don't know if this was like a return or if somebody was just having a really bad day when they were packing my stuff and they just threw everything in there. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm a little upset about it. All right, um, so the other thing I picked up is in here, which did come nicely packed. So I got the 
Joe Malone Red Roses Body and Hand Wash. I absolutely love the Joe Malone um, hand wash. It is such a splurge. It is such a treat. And I wanted to get the Red Roses one. Um, it does come with a nice pump and these last me a while. So I had to get it. I had to pick it up while it was on sale. Oh my goodness, it smells so, so good. Like a bouquet of fresh Red Roses. It just smells incredible. And then my free gift with purchase was the English Parent Freesia Cologne in the nine milliliter size. I love these. I absolutely love the scent and I love having these sizes in my purse. So I thought it was a great deal because I was getting the 15% off the little gift. Um, and then the lantern just drew me in, you know, like I really wanted that lantern. <laughs> so that's what I picked up from Jo Malone from Macy's. Okay, let's continue. Next up, we have YSL. I picked up a new lipstick and the new fragrance. I got the Libre Le Absolute Platinum. I have um, uh, the other Libre perfume and I Leap perfume and I really, really love it. And I wanted, I think I have the Auto Perfume one. And I wanted to try the Platinum one. Now I'm gonna pull up the notes just so we can see the notes before I open it and spray it. So this is the floral fragrance family and the key notes are orange blossom, lavender, and white lavender. So let's just open it up and I'm gonna go ahead and spray it um, because it is the only fragrance I have here. So let's give it a shot. Oh wow. I love the packaging. Oh my gosh, it's like this platinum with the gold. It is gorgeous. I think I sprayed way too much. If I don't like it, <laughs> I'm gonna be stuck with it. All right. Ooh. It's like a very deep fragrance that I think I usually don't gravitate towards, but I actually really like it. Mmm. Smells really nice. You know what? Let me pull up all the notes. I, it smells like perfect for fall and winter, if if you ask me. Okay, so the top notes are bergamot and mandarin orange. Middle notes are lavender, orange blossom, and blue lavender. And base notes are vanilla and amber. I got a burst of that vanilla initially. The moment you spray it, I got the vanilla note. Yeah, it smells really nice. Um, I would say kind of like soapy, like clean. That's what comes to mind, but I don't know, guys. I like it. I, I get that vanilla and like a soapy clean scent from this. I'm going to have to wear this out and see how it wears on me. Um, my first impression is good, but also I don't know if this is something I would wear often. <laughs> it's not my type of fragrance. It's not like light and feminine. Although I feel like it is feminine, I also feel like it could be unisex where a man can wear this. And I don't normally gravitate towards a cologne or fragrance that men can wear because I prefer the light airy, uh, fruity, floral, citrusy, like feminine fragrances. So I don't know if this is for me. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I love the way the bottle looks more than I love the scent, but I'll have to wear this and see. I'll definitely have to give it the wear test. And then I also got a lipstick. This is the oil and stick um, ready to care and shine color in the shade one to one beige satin i love the formula of these lipsticks it is super super um glossy hydrating just perfect and the packaging is always beautiful with the gold and i've never seen this shade before so i wanted to try it um so again this is the beige satin so here it is I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it. Okay, so here it is. 
it's like a neutral shade i think this will look really nice on and then for the ysl purchase i had this gift with purchase which came a little banged up as well but it's the ysl label tag so let me open this up okay i think mine actually i think there's supposed to be like another piece to it it's supposed to be a tag like but this is how it came i think there's supposed to be another piece to this boy i'm like i'm really disappointed today with everything <laughs> what okay so i also picked up one pack of the shiseido cottons my favorite cottons i always get them during a sale so i got a couple of things from dior I got the Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet Roller Pearl. I thought this was really neat to keep in my purse. I love the Blooming Bouquet fragrance, but it doesn't last long on me. So I figured, you know what? I could spray it in the morning and then keep this in my purse for touch-ups. And because it's not liquid, it's not gonna spill. I don't have to worry about it as much. So I picked it up and I, I do think it's gonna be really nice to have and it's a really fancy rollerball perfume let me show you how fancy this is it's also a really nice size you get how big is this yeah you get 20 mls which usually i think rollerballs are 10 mils and this one is 20. but look at how fancy this is i just had to have it for a rollerball how fancy is this? Okay. So let me let me use it. Oh, this is so so good. Blooming bouquet, Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet. It's one of my top favorite fragrances. It is super super feminine, super beautiful. I just absolutely love it, and I just think this is so neat for the rollerball um to keep in your purse how cute is that then i got a mascara and let me show you how the mascara arrived <laughs> like this i did not take it out of the packaging i kid you not the mascara was laying like in my box just like this and the packaging for the mascara is flat and laying like this and I don't know how this could have happened because even if it was like rough shipment, how could mascara come out of the packaging? You tell me. Was this packed already like this? Or do you think this happened during shipment? Because in my opinion, I don't think the, the mascara could have walked out of the packaging on its own, could it? I don't know but this is how it came and I think I'm gonna send it back the same way because this to me is either used or damaged I don't know but I don't feel comfortable using it when it's like this it's a shame because I really love this mascara and I really wanted this but and the sale is over now so I can't pick it up anymore but I just don't feel comfortable and then the other thing I picked up is this, which is the concealer. It's Forever Skin Correct Concealer in the shade 0N. It came opened like this. Again, I did not open that. It came like that. But this is the concealer. I am so disappointed with my stuff. I don't know what happened. And then this was my gift with my purchase for the Dior stuff. So the gift came pretty nicely packed <laughs> considering everything else so i do have this large um, pouch which i already have gotten one of these before and i really really love it you, you know you could use this for anything not just makeup it is so so nice so spacious it zips up i absolutely love this pouch and then i also got a lipstick and a perfume mini so I got the mini of the Miss Dior and then I got a mini lipstick in the 100 nude look which is a neutral shade. So th these are really nice gifts from Dior. This is the lipstick. Look at how cute. And it is such a beautiful 
nude shade and you get so much product in here for a sample i'm actually using one of these samples right now and like it's it's taking me a while to finish so i know that these go a long way i picked up the giorgio armani luminous silk perfect glow flawless foundation in shade 1.5 i recently finished mine so i picked up another one not only did i get 15 percent off of it but i got a free full-size lipstick with it um, it was a promo where if you buy this foundation you get this lipstick and then the foundation was 15% off and I already finished mine, so it was a no-brainer. Um, I absolutely love uh, this foundation. It is so, so pretty on, so I'm really happy to have it. And then I got a free lipstick, the Lip Power Longwear Lipstick in this shade, um, In Love 108. Let's see the shade. I love these lipsticks. The formula is super hydrating. Um, the actual lipstick is super pretty with the black and the red and um, here's the shade and again this is in love then I also picked up two of the wet brushes hair brushes I do really like this I picked up one for my husband and one of these for my mom and um, I also got a free gift with this and again, these were 15% off. And then I got the wet brush, um, mini detangler brush for free. So I thought that was really nice. Um, then I also got two Chanel products. I got the Hydra Beauty Essence Mist. I love this as my setting spray. I have mine right here, so I'm not gonna open this one, but I feel like I'm running low on this, so I figured I'm gonna get this while i can get some kind of a deal and then i also saw this in stock my favorite lipstick this is the rouge coco flash 54 boy i again have this but i i don't have a lot left and this is like a beautiful nude shade that i absolutely want to have in my collection and then with my purchase i got a little chanel gift so it came like this and it's just a couple of pieces four pieces but that's really nice for chanel so you get the Hydra Beauty um, Fortifying Replenishing Hydration Cream. Um, we got the Micellar Cleansing Water Sample. We have the Essence. And lastly, we've got the Cleansing Cream to Foam. So these are really nice to get with your purchase because normally you don't really get gifts with Chanel so I thought that was nice um, so that is everything that I picked up from Macy's during their sale and um, now I'm gonna grab my phone and I'm gonna screen record my phone and we're gonna pick the winner for the Chanel giveaway okay guys so I am ready to select the winner I'm gonna do a screen recording on my phone and hopefully I'll pop it on the screen so we can see it at the same time Lindsay Beth, you're the winner for the Chanel giveaway. Congratulations. So um, there we go. We have our winner and it's Lindsay Beth. Congratulations on winning the Chanel giveaway. I'm so happy for you. All you have to do is you need to email me at unboxwithme2021 at gmail.com. You need to provide your full mailing address and you need to comment underneath this video with your email address up to the sign at. So if it were me, I would put Unbox With Me 2021. And you need to do this within 24 hours of this video. I hope everybody is staying healthy and well, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.